Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to our Mayo Taxi 2.01 playthrough in EU4 with me, your host, Luke and Marie. It's been about a month since I, I did this. Work has uh, has gone on top of me a little bit. The part-time job uh, that was just to help a friend out has turned into full-time plus extra hours. With it coming to Christmas, I'm not surprised. Anyway, <clears throat> I haven't... Uh, I haven't done anything in Cradle of Civilization. Uh, I was meant to jump on the bandwagon and get something out immediately, but I decided to wait a little bit. Anyway, um, this has come out, the Japan update, as of yesterday, I believe, which is uh, which is pretty cool. Philippines is now settled archipelago, divided by religion. There's seven new nations, seven new nations. Holy moly, uh, a new idea group, etc, etc. Uh, there's more people lumped into Japan. Cool. So after this, I'm probably going to end up doing, I don't know, something in the Philippines, maybe. I don't think we've had a game in the Philippines yet. Uh, I've had to roll back our game to the uh, to 1.22, because that's where my own taxes works. Any further on than that, and uh, yeah, it fails to load. So if you're having trouble, if you... If you You've been looking through this um, this playthrough and thought it's great, and downloaded Mayo and Taxes, and suddenly you can't get anything to work. It's because you need to. Uh, I'll show you here. Actually, you need to go into here, into properties, into DLC, no betas, betas, and select the version that you need. What for Mayo and Taxes is one point two two point two old version. Uh, we will skip the ungraceful exit there. Do I have them on? No, let's turn that off. And that's off. And that off, I don't know why they're on. We should have. Minimum taxes, yep. Yeah. And that is it. If you're having trouble with getting my own taxes to run in the new update, even if you go back, <clears throat> just turn any additional mods off and you should be good, he says. We'll see. So yeah, it's been about a month since I've played this game. Uh, if you, you see the symbol down here, or if you, you saw the symbol down at the bottom of the screen, uh, it denotes that I, I now have an Oculus Rift. So I've lost about, oh, about two weeks. To the land of virtual reality and it's amazing it really is the resolution isn't amazing the resolution isn't uh <clears throat> isn't brilliant but that will come with time it'll come with time and graphics cards that are available um graphics cards that are able to deal with rendering all those uh those pixels at the same time but just it looks like you. It feels like, especially with driving games and having to look further down the road. It can feel like you're an old man whose glasses have shaken off uh, with having to squint. But but what it lacks in resolution, it definitely makes up for in immersion. It's absolutely brilliant. Got on the uh, Black Friday sale, so 350 quid with uh, with two sensors, and yeah, lost about two weeks of my life to it. Two weeks that I gladly gave. So how are we getting on here? We're not that far away from the end of the game. I don't believe. I think we're finishing something like 1820 odd. Oh, and Dylan's fixed. Um, last time I spoke to you all, he was. Uh, he was a little bit ill. Yeah, I know. I know. He was a little bit ill. Um, ended up taking him to the vets and uh, he got injections for having a stupid high, high temperature. And uh, he, he wasn't pooping, which which is quite bad, actually. Um, so, yeah. He's now fixed. Back to his poopy ways. Once I had a, a paramedic mate of mine who uh, who used to tell me strange things 
usually about people who take lots of drugs, um, like heroin addicts. They get really, really, really bad constipation to the point where they were vomiting feces. It's like, yep, uh, I'll, I'll not do drugs then. <laughs> anyway, let's get on with Spain after the uh, <clears throat> feces related story. Last time I checked, Fourth Haitian War for Independence, but that was covered by our dudes. Our many dudes. And we were back at war with Ming. But this was the Ming Spanish, so it's the one that they kicked off against us for Chinese unification, but we cheesed them similarly to how we cheesed them before. And we still got taken Moscow. We, we do. And we can get seven more. So we will. This is proper gumbo diplomacy, isn't it? We, we just used our huge navy, our huge and advanced navy to lock them down. I think we only have a few troops over here. But where do we want to go? Where do we need to be? My mind is a bit of a fog at the moment. All right, we have troops over here. We have a random two stack in Great Britain. We that cause, but we don't because we can't make them. Hey, Dylan, enough. Enough. I know you're fixed now. That doesn't mean you can gob off over every single video again. Restore the Empire of Romania. I think we've done this before, haven't we? We, we did it, and then we switched back. Uh, I think we at that point we discovered that it was bugged out, and we were getting loads of prestige for it. So we never did it again. Did we not build the Panama Canal? We did. It's here. And we have rebels. Let's try and uh, and put them down. Sunni fanatics. Wonder why I wasn't dealing with them before. Was that speaking of rebels? Looks like we have quite a few ships being built. We have 100% spy network in Venice. There'll be a reason for that. I've just realised that my display is on. Uh, 1440 instead of 1080. So if these little, if these menus are tiny for you and you can't uh, and you can't see them, it's because I've messed up. Before the next episode, I will endeavour to change them back to the uh, the 1080p resolution. I think I have to do it via my desktop. Who are you allied with? I declared war on you, Naples. We did want to get to Naples, but they've been capped off. <clears throat> by Mr. Popeyman, and because we remained staunchly Catholic, I don't really want to be. Sienna still pisses me off. Uh, yeah, I, I don't really want to be pissing off the head of the uh, head of the church. Although we can take this lump here, I suppose. Is there a... Yeah, I know. I know. I should have gone another religion. Fume, Lorraine, and Venice. Ooh. We have a claim. Why is it not Cananada? What have I done there? What have I done there? Not Can Cananda. Cananda? Who allowed me to do this? Ah, oh, what nonsense. Uh, also, I would like to go to war with Britain. If, wow. If, if only... Breaking truth. Portugal, yep. Yeah. If only to, uh... To make this yellow and, and not red anymore. When is our truce with you over? 1817 next year I think we go for that then 
Where are all my troops? I know I shipped a load to India because they... Uh, not a load, 36,000. Might have to build some more people. 48k down here. <clears throat> yeah, we are having issues down here as well, aren't we? Just because of the... Uh, the large amount of population that are down here. The rebels that were popping were huge. As in, many in number, not... Rotund. Uh, Ming, what would you... What would you give us? You give us war reps. You give us the entirety of that island. Didn't want to release somebody. <clears throat> I think I want to release somebody up here. No, it's it's getting towards the end of the game now, isn't it? Um, I think we just go purely for land. Oh my word! What? 148 diplo. So we're already in a diplo hole. <clears throat> oh. Well, what can we do? Cancel subjects? Not really. Release nations? Hmm. Not in the war goal. Yeah, it's it's not in the war goal for us. Sorry if this is really tiny. Uh, it's not in the war goal for us. But if Ming have declared war on us, we should be able to demand things off them. And it not cost us so much diplo, I don't think. I think if you, you declare a war, but you get your poop kicked in, I think it should be cheaper for the enemy to take stuff off you. It's it's the price of declaring war. Declaring a pointless war, or declaring a war that you lost. There has to be some, some comeback to it. And I'll give us decisions at half diplo cost. That would be, uh, be alright. What's the population here then? 56, 87, yeah. I mean, the sooner this is over, the sooner we can transport all our dudes back towards Britain. Get that kicked off <clears throat> mid next year. How much would that be? We would probably be able to get that. War ups and humiliate. Papal consistory. Uh, appoint every candidate, of course. How do we still play the game? Yeah, we're still playing the games. Good, good, <clears throat> good, 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 good. Nope, nope, and nope, we can make states. How many states can we make and why can we make them? We have 38 states, but we can make 41. So we'll make another two if we can. Flanders, Flanders, why are you not a state? Did I not state this? Evidently not. I will say that. E enough. Oi. Tanger, Leone, Champagne, which is down here. Yep. Dylan. I'm not going to wish for you to be ill again. But I will make you ill. I won't. No, I won't. I won't make you ill. Purchase control of the church overseas. There's one over here that I wanted to do as well. <clears throat> Something about removing um, land from the church. Is it down here?
I have no idea where it's gone now. Rebuild the Theodesian walls. Why can we not do that? We do own Constantinople. Oh, we need a military engineer. Persecute other religions? No. Donate lands to the church? No. We need the... The other one. The one where we take land off them. I don't know. Anyway. <clears throat> Let's carry on. Serbia have insulted us. Serbia have insulted us. <laughs> but why? Where's our nearest forces? 20,000. Serbia can't have that much. No, go that way. Okay. Uh oh. Just randomly clicked the first random click of uh, of this month. Well done. You're getting taken back anyway. I'll go back up to Gaza. What level is your fort? Level four. Uh, I could do with bringing these up. And who are you? Two random trade ships. You transports? You are. Alright, we'll, we'll take some extra people over towards Serbia. Gain a one whole singular corrupt corruption. I think we already have quite high corruption, but it's it's kind of leveled out at about five. It's all right. And Haiti wants out. No, I'm not letting you go. There we go. And all the money. Done. Ah, oh, damn it. Hopefully, uh, hopefully our minions will be able to take care of him. <clears throat> Maybe. I want to hold your breath though. Pick up this eleven stack, and we will get amongst a Serbia. Why have they got the old Savoy flag? Looks like it. Ah, I see. Let's pick these guys up. Church calls a conclave. We will see what they call. Spanish particularists. Spanish particularists. Why would we have particularists? I don't know. Anyway, Ming, do you want to get out? Wait, what? I'm sure we were closer than that last time. Oh, we can wait. Good. Sugar will be now pre produced in that place there. It's blended. The game's struggling a little bit. Are we there yet? We are. Good. On the boat. And uh, let's go put down some rebels. OK, 
capable or saintly? Go with capable. I think we always do capable. Good. Good. You can be up there and we'll we'll take out these guys. You jump onto the capital. And the greater noble loyalty improves. What have we got here? <clears throat> What's our stability? Plus one. Good. Excellent. Did I not tell you to? Oh, you are standing in this province. It's just, uh, it says that you're not. All right. Uh oh. Uh, we'll go for inhuman. Religious tensions take our chances. Fifty percent chance gain ten unrest in fairs. Oh, if you ever, <clears throat> if you ever play in this game, and you're Spain, just just leave out North Africa. Just if I could give one piece of advice, it's just don't go into Africa. It's not worth it. It's not worth the hassle. Okay. Okay, okay. All right, I want you up to the capital here. We'll take the capital, and then we'll put another twenty thousand back in the uh, the Sinai to deal with rebels because they will end up popping off. And what can we take? Shipbuilding time. Yeah. Can we spend more money here? Got national unrest and monthly autonomy change. Tons of heretics. Tons of true faith goes up. Tons of heathens goes down. Uh. Production, tech cost, idea cost. Production. Diplo wrap, improved relations, diplo tech cost minus 2.5. Trade efficiency and national tax modifier would be nice. Global tariffs would be nice as well, actually. We do make a lot from global tariffs, I believe. Hmm, 139 ducats. Can we afford three level threes? I think we can. This might be better though, in terms of making a little bit, a, per, a percentage of the money back. Yeah, let's go with that. Um, do we need this anymore? Do we need to centralize anymore? Hmm. I don't think we do. And it's costing us an admin point. So I'll get rid of that. In terms of stability, we get 15 points per year. Our yearly multiplier is 1.5. Right. <clears throat> We will... where is this? No. That, I believe, is a state. Good. Can we call anything else? Can we call, not state? We can. Flemish. Oh, of course, the... Uh, the 
provinces that we just stated. Oh, yeah, that's all right. Corruption of Sankey. Uh, it's a little off to deal with it. Let's have a look at where this plague is, if I can remember, for the life of me, how to find it. <clears throat> now, I don't want to be closing the ports or restricting trade. Um, so it's over here. But it's not that bad, it's only mild. Yeah, it, it, it'll be alright. It'll be okay. What's our population at the moment? That's quite a lot of population. Twelve thousand two hundred and eighty-two. I think that roughly. I think that's 12 million uh, 282,000 but uh, yeah we'll give it to the end of the year see how uh, the plague has affected us but because we're so big and sprawling now I don't think plague here is going to affect us too much or it shouldn't do anyway right we Definitely need you in there. We'll swap you there. And on you go. Uh, no. Okay. Okay. And siege is over. Oh, you continue onwards. Serbia, so how about. Coalition with Great Britain? Don't care. Still just a coalition with Great Britain. That would. I'd be happy with that. Yeah, I'd be happy with that. It kind of, it, it makes it a, a nice border there. For far too long there has been gore here. No longer. And how are we getting on down here? Well, we're kind of holding our own. Got a good back row. Together. Blind Separatist, uh, we evidently didn't get there in time. I'm surprised they managed to win that, but well done. And oh, let's charge them down. Good. Good. Again, national C B against Canada. Oh, of our culture group. Yeah, fair enough. That's all right. I doubt we'll be going to war with Canada anytime soon. You jump on that. You in behind to deal with the nine stack. We'll probably try making a head to the capital. Nope. You'll be inhuman. <clears throat> it means that the plague spreads, but it also means that we're not losing massive amounts of population to just killing them with our own hand um, twenty five go on then now Ming do you want out? Well, that do that will do sweet and some money get yourself away Decisive victory. <clears throat> How do we lose so many? Attrition. Yeah, I can understand that. Oh. 
a win is a win. And that means that we can use our trade fleet for doing trade related shenanigans. Let's have you protecting trade. Where do we have our merchants? Malacca Strait. North Sea, nope. Where are our ships? I have no idea. I have absolutely no idea where any of our ships are. Um, I'm going to guess the vast majority are going to be plodding around in, uh, in the seas off China. So let's just bring all our... Oh, I don't know. Just, is there a way of clicking them without having to no having to go all the way over there yeah unless <clears throat> unless China decide to kick off with us again I think that's going to be the last what are you? 22 transports yeah okay that makes sense I'll leave you there uh, I think that's going to be the last of our incursion into Asia. Ten transports here, right? And the two trade ships that are here waiting. Good. Alright, you'll take that. Of course you'll take that. How about also anything else? No. Time bit money, go. We'll go for Tensor Treasury. Get some stability points. A little bit of stability points. And our truce with Britain is over. I wanted to, I wanted to already be into Britain by the time that happened, but Serbia decided to insult us. And I'm not one for being insulted, not today. How are we with tech? Ahead of time, quite far ahead of time. And what is this with uh, the tech penalty? That's oh, because we need 30,000 in, in order to get rid of that tech penalty. Can that money be used to better? I think I was going to upgrade my capital building in Cadiz, wasn't I? Rank 4 capital building. Needs 24,000. Needs 24,000. But it will increase our communication, communication efficiency everywhere in our country by an extra 2.5%. Which... I'm not, well, I'm not going to say it'll pay for itself, but... No, it, it won't pay for itself. But it, it, it's efficiency, and I like efficiency. Just realised I'd sent those, those, those uh, transports home. Uh, we'll try and keep them here. Uh, steel jewelry naval supplies. Alright, that's good with jewelry then. Group you two together. We should be able to fit you all on the same boat. Do we not? Where have those transports gone? Are they still here? Oh, it's still there. Burgers demand privilege. I 
think we go for there. Oh my word. Come on, we've only just dodged one bullet. Well, you can lose zero loyalty. I think towards late game, some of the numbers get a little bit messed up. Alright, so all of you want to deposit you straight onto the island of Britain. We'll have 20,000 on the boats there because this is a, a, a hotbed of rebellion as it as it is even in even in these days and 45,000 I'm gonna need more troops do I have anyone in the new world just like chilling out somewhere Not really. 15,000. We're going to need about 20,000 around here. I think I'll be able to, uh, to move the rest on. Yeah, about 25,000 there. Okay. And our ships are starting to... Uh, to get back from Asia. Alright, you on the boat. At least 20,000 of you. Aren't you up? Toward Britain as well. We'll be coming back for that uh, round of five stack. What is this? Province culture shift. Good news and first, the population of Nara Fora have embraced a new culture. Castilian. Nara Fora is Navarra, isn't it? Is this new music? Or is it just because I haven't played it for a while? Might not be. Huzzah? Good. Um, at some point we stopped accepting... Nav Nav Navarros? Navarese? Nav oh, what's it called? Basque. Fucking hell. <laughs> we, we stopped... Of course it's Basque. Weirdo. Uh, yeah, we stopped accepting Basque. Uh, and if you have an accepted culture on your doorstep, <clears throat> you'll never convert that culture. However, if it's not accepted, then you will end up inevitably converting it at some point. So you don't want to be... Uh, Accepting tiny cultures on your, on your doorstep. Or if you have, then mid game. Stop accept, stop accepting them. So that they can uh, they can flip. Pooped out a lot of ships here. No, uh-uh, no. We colonize this. Why would do, why do we have Biman separatists in a place that we colonized? Why do we have any separatists in a place where we colonized? Uh, 
we're going to need transports down here, aren't we? Damn it. Forgot how uh, important. No. Forgot how. It's, it's not just important. It's, it's a necessity to have transports. A lot of transports. They're probably all in here, aren't they? Well, at least there's 20 of them. Heavies, let's send you towards Britain. Twenty stack of transports, let's send you to the Philippines. Now let's have a look at our trade map mode now. How far is this plague spread? Yeah. It was already quite weak. Yeah, it was already quite weak, so... I think... Closing our ports and doing all the plague measures, it'd have been... It'd have... Not been good. Severe plague. In Calais. Yeah, I can imagine that. There's only one, 21 pop there. It'll be fine. Terrible province drama. Why? For reasons. It would appear. Raiders turn back. Good. Some more prestige. Not that we need it. Let's go squish these. Are you finished? You are. Splendid. Judge of Canada, A. Eh? Uh, give the church authority over Canada, A. Eh? There's 10 liberty desire. There's 20 liberty desire. We'll uh, allow them to lose 20 liberty desire. States are restless. Grand nobles lose 10 loyalty, but we gain 15 prestige. Gain 10 corruption, but we gain 10 absolutism. Yeah, it's interesting. Might go with this one, actually. Gets us a decent lump of corruption, but... He's okay. So I squished one. Who's this now? Alright. Well, we knew stuff was going to be uh, popping off there. Squish one. Make sure it's properly squished. So it doesn't run off and cause havoc somewhere else. Sorted. Transport's still out there. Good. There we go. And back down to where we usually sit. So our transports are hiding that way, which means we should have a decent lump in here. 43, is that enough? Don't think so. I have a 20 stack here. What have I done? Must have been on transports that landed. Okay, so, <clears throat> trade. Where do we funnel things into? Mostly Cadiz, although we are collecting in uh, what what is the Genoa node and the Venetian node. But here are different Tyrrhenian Sea and Adriatic Sea. Looks like we could do with ships in the North Sea. 
We're losing uh, five ducats over to to Cologne. How about the Caribbean? Caribbean. Right, away you go that way. The other hundred. Protect trade. Guinea Coast. Where are you? Yep. Enough. Stop. Game, please. Oh my word. Stop. What is this? Lose 40 admin power or just spend loads of money? I will just spend loads of money. Now, no, mo no matter what happens here, whether it goes along this route, it's still pretty much controlled by us. And if it goes down this route, again, it's still controlled by us, sort of, to an extent. We still get a, a lump of it. So what do we do with our other ships? Um... Probably best over here somewhere. Try to get trade to flow around Africa and into Cadiz instead of coming up through and being diluted. Yeah, we'll do that. Don't have a trader here. We don't have a merchant here. But then we also don't have land there either. So a fleet in Ceylon sent its money straight to the cave. So anything that comes and hits sail on here, we push it down this line instead of it getting dragged up and dispersed around. Um, next one down, we're looking at probably the Moluccas. Yeah, it's, it's far more valuable. Where are you getting yours from? Australia. In the base game, you don't have this line. There's a lot of stuff that happens in South America. South America. South Africa. There's a lot of uh, trade power. A lot of ducats that pass through South Africa. If you can cap South Africa off and have it for yourself. Well, kind of. I, don't, I still don't think we can get into it. I'll call this the send. Oh, we might build it. Yeah, so Ceylon and I think. Yeah. Last few ships to the Moluccas. I like it straight. Nope. The Malukas. There we go. Anything being pirated. Yeah. Well, we need our heavies for the fight with Britain, so. 
we'll just have to deal with pirates for a while. Oh, it's 10% of the population will be converted to state religion. Good. Alright, so we're... Where's our transports? Oh, yeah. Let's get you squishing all these guys. I don't think we need 40,000 down here. I think just 22,000 will do. Although, when we go to war with Britain, we'll also be at war with Portugal, I believe. Yep. If we were to go to war with Portugal, it randomly bring in Pascal. How weird and bizarre. <clears throat> Alright, so we'll declare war on Britain. We we'll take out the uh, Portuguese holdings here. Where's Portugal's capital now? I mean, they're already in trouble a little bit. Oh, it's okay. Um, yeah, we'll be right. What about you get? Improved relations plus 10, or improved relations plus 10. Okay. Grab some abandoned. Nope, try and keep them here. We'll go for silk as well. And press this issue. Are we there yet? Just come across the Bay of Biscay. Horrific portion of sea. Gets really, really rough here. You go out. Okay. And I think we're about ready to go. Britain, what do you have? Oh, should we take that ledger? We could have gone to war with them a lot sooner. Right, so declare war for Oxford. Confirm that and let's go. Hopefully our minions can do a good job here as well. We will... Where is this? Anjou. No. I can hold them. We lost a singular ship. That's fine. We will heavily restrict looting because we want this land for ourselves. You're going to take that back. Good. Britain, do you have stuff down here? I think we made Britain give up all... Uh, is this Britain? No. I think we made him give up the majority of his stuff over here. In the last war that we had with him.
Yeah, this war, 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 blah, blah, blah. this war with Britain is to to make this look prettier. I get rid of Canada, get rid of British holdings over here, and at some point I want to go to war with Iceland because this is just this is ridiculous. Iceland, how close are your holdings? Iceland is there, which means if we can take this and fabricate it directly upon Iceland. Might need to be a thing that happens. Whereabouts is that? Yeah, that's fine. Eruption. Lots of eruptions that happened. Good. Should have taken more score. To an extent. You sit on Suffolk, you sit on Lincoln, I believe. We'll trap this guy here. Trade value, tax, oh, it's only local. That doesn't matter. All right, let's blockade the capital as well. That was a quick siege. Portugal, if we separately pieced you out for your holdings down here, how much would that piss you off? Piece of value for 79. <clears throat> what, else, what else do you have? Yeah, we'll try and take this off uh, of Portugal. Try and limit them to just this position here. Forty thousand. I would think we have the transports over here to get this set to order. Hmm. All right, let's get you over here. We're going to need more troops. Should be able to spit them out by the time he's got here. If not, we can just build them on this side of the Aegean. Capital is done. Great, that is all the Portuguese holdings down there, I think. Should be. I don't know if I'm going to be... I don't know. Like I say, I don't think I'd be confident in moving troops around. However, we do have a hundred trade fleet here. Yeah, I'll, I'll move troops up. like we're going to have to deal with that as well. Winner. Sunni fanatics. Damn it. There's not even that many of them. It'll be one of those pop-ups that I just randomly flicked off. Okay. 
you're done, you're done. Let's pick you up and put you somewhere better. And we need uh, we need our general over here. Oh, we need more men. What's your composition? Twenty-one to thirteen. Thirty-six against almost sixty thousand. That's not going to be good. Hopefully he moves on to level 8 fort and we'll have a little bit of time. But I believe Marine, as always, you lot have been amazing. Apologize for the, uh, the the brief lull in videos going out. Again, being a little bit busy, but back into this now. It's amazing how much you, uh, you forget in just a month. Fired up the game and I was like, I have no idea what I'm doing right now. As was probably evident. By my uh, by my fumblings around. Anyway, until next time, until tomorrow. Do take care.